Hello everyone! So I wanted to film this haul video from a couple of different places um, so let me get started. I placed an order um, with Lavish Laces um, and I think most of you know that's Gisela here on YouTube. Uh, Lavish Laces um, rosette trim is what I purchased actually. Um, so see, these are some of the small white rosettes and I got some of the regular size rosettes. I got quite a bit of that. And then I got some of the cream, and these are the regular sized. Well, actually, I think these are the smaller ones. I don't know. No, these are the regular sized, I think, in cream. And then I got some of these smaller ones. And I ordered some of the leaves in the green and yellow, the green and brown, and the pink and green. Sorry for the glare, guys. So I got some of those, and then I ordered some more rosettes. So there's a purple polka dotted one, and that's a regular size. There's a blue polka dotted one, and that's a regular size. And then there's just a blue, baby blue, my favorite color. Um, and then there's a peach. And then I wanted to show you Gisela, of course, she didn't have to, but thank you very much, Gisela, for including some extras in the package. And so I want to show you those because it's very sweet of her to do that. So she included some of these little green and brown leaves, which I did not get. I got the larger ones. Um, so that was very nice of her to do that. I'm definitely going to use these in my project so you can see this is what she gave me and these are the sizes that I ordered so that's perfect and she also included some of these which I didn't get either um, these are the peach colored ones I love the color of these these will go great with the rosettes or that I ordered as well as some that she gave me so here's some green this is kinda like a celery color I wanna say or a leaf green maybe here's some purple and it's like a I want to say cheetah print with some sparkles in it. There's um, like a pumpkin color with some hearts and there's some yellow in here. I love that. I'm going to try and make one of the flowers that she was showing. I have enough rosettes of this one. I think I'll try and make one of those because um, I think it needs two and a half rosettes maybe. This is like a coral color. And then here's a lighter green color. This is more like a celery, I guess. Or sea foam. <laughs> here's one that's a print. And that's kind of wild and crazy. I like that. Um, and then the last one is this like pink and navy. This one is really soft. It's made from a different material than, say, like the white rosettes that I got. But it's really soft. I love that. So that is what I got from Lavish Laces. You should check out her store on Etsy if you haven't already. I think most of you have that watch my videos. But definitely check her out. At great prices as well. Um, and thank you, Vicky, for the tip. Because I did ask Vicky, um, who is TryHeart67 here on YouTube. She makes those puffy flowers. And I was just wondering where she ordered hers from. And she mentioned... Um, Gisela's store and I had seen her store before I just hadn't ordered from her um, so um, from Scrap Ace they have a daily deals website um, and I saw this on another video and wanted to purchase the um, stamp set it's this one that I particularly wanted which is the Graphic 45 Bird Song um, this is the fan stamp but you can Put these images inside of this stamp here and I had been meaning to purchase this and then Scrap Ace had a deal for all three stamps for $13.99 I believe it was for all three stamp sets for $13.99 so I went ahead and purchased the set so this is like an Asian themed if you can tell stamp sets so there's that one there's this one that has a dragon. That's really cool. 
And then there's this one, which has the peacock, some lanterns, and then there's some cherry blossoms, and then it says bird song. So the other thing, too, is that I think this comes out to, per set, $6.32. That's including the shipping, so that was a great deal to me. I don't think you could get it for that cheap anywhere else. I don't know. Um, I went to Office Depot today. I'm going to get to this, these stacks you're seeing to get more of these little pockets, and these are um, Office Depot brand. 4x6 clear pockets, and this is what I used to store my small stamp sets. And um, so I got a couple of packages of these because I ran out, and then they only had one left of the larger one, which I still have some of, so not a big problem. 5x8 for these. And there's 10 per package, and um, so yeah, that's what I use to store my stamp sets now. Um, and little did I know. Office Depot is carrying washi tape. So, when I saw the washi tape, I was like, oh, really cute. These are all washi tapes made by Scotch. And I'm sorry for the glare, but they're they're wrapped in plastic. So, you can see here, it actually says Scotch Expressions washi tape. So, I got some of them. Some of them. So, here's some of the ones that I got. I like this one because these are little triangle banners. And that's like a wood grain, but it's green. That looks like to me like, I don't know, like a metro map, <laughs> sort of. So those are some. And then I got some of the wider ones, which they had, like this. So this one is like little speech bubbles. This one's more like um, patterns, different colored triangles and stuff. This one's like a superhero one. So it says like, boom vroom, what else, wham, so it reminds me of the old Batman TV series, or comics, comics, yeah, comics, where they have those sayings, but I thought this was cute, I actually had that su superhero pad too, so that would go great with that, and then I got this one, which is like black and white chevron, so those are the washies that I caught. Um, and of course, um, I also saw these at Staples when I was shopping. I had to show these. I went to get some refills for my um, notebook. And they had these really cute post-it notes, mustaches, and bowler hats. They had other kinds, but I only got these two. And there's two per pack. So I may be sharing that with some crafty friends. And then, what else did I get? I went to Marshall's, and this was in a different... I didn't show these, but I found these clothespins. Not clothespins. They're clips. And I pulled one out. You can see here, it's like this. And I, I think you can probably use these to decorate, you know, to alter or whatever. Um, but they're very handy. Uh, I had them clipped together here. And they were $2 a bag. And there's 12... It says there's 12 clips in here, and some are green, some are like a light yellow, and then some are blue, and then th this is like a salmon color. So, and they're um, vinyl coated, and that that's the color of the vinyl. They're not painted, so I thought that was kind of nice. So I got those. Um, what else did I get? Oh, I ordered some of the hangers from Amador. Um, Amador, his YouTube channel is Amador Eros here on YouTube, and he showed these in his um, his um, video. So I ordered the two blue ones, two blue regular ones, and as you guys know, um, my craft room is a light blue, so these fit in perfectly. And if anybody chooses to send... oh. So I'll mention that, you know, I'm having a giveaway. It's the Something Blue um, Crafty Challenge giveaway. And you all still have time to join because it goes through the month of August into September. So I will leave the link below for the video. Um, check it out, and I hope you all can join in. But So I purchased these in case anybody decides to send me a project that I can hang, and I'll use these to hang them in my craft room. So I got two of the regular blue hangers. They're so cute. And then two of the cream-colored hearts.
so and that may not be coming through very well but anyway so Amador if you're watching thank you for um for you know making these so that people other people who don't want to have to make them like me <laughs> could purchase them from you I appreciate you doing that and they got here very quickly and safe and sound there was nothing you know wrong with the packaging it, it came across just fine so thank you for doing that um, and I got them at I think a great deal because you know you put a lot of effort into making them so I appreciate that so what else did I do I stopped at Michael's today because I actually had gone to the Office Depot and it's in the same plaza as the Michael's and the TJ Maxx. So at Michael's I purchased these heart-shaped clips. They were in the dollar bin. So I got these. And by the way, I used my 20% off the entire purchase coupon for my purchase that I'm going to show you. So I got these. I also got these flowers, a couple of each. I don't know if you can see these very well, but they're like a pattern pink and green. And these are a pattern pink and pink cream. And there's like a little pearl in the middle. And they're layered. They're not just a single layer. I don't know if anybody's seen these, but these are the patchwork monogram is the line that it's in. These were in the dollar bin. So I got four packages. And let me show you what I also got going to show these last. Sorry guys. So I went into Michael's because I was watching Jaredel's video. She had a vlog and she had gone to Michael's. Well, she'd gone to Joanne's and then she went to Michael's. Um, Jaredel is Crafty Me 83 if you guys don't know or watch her channel. Um, you should check it out. Um, I was catching up on her videos and she showed that she had gone to Joanne's they had a advertisement in the Joanne circular that doesn't end until like the 10th. It's a long one. And they're showing DCWV stacks for, for selected stacks for $5. So she went in and had them price match it at Michael's. I don't have this stack yet. And this is that um, vintage collector stack, which just came out recently. Um, it's been a couple of weeks, maybe. Um, so I decided to do the same thing, and my Michaels let me do it. She had to ask, you know, somebody in there, and they said yes, okay, because it didn't show which stacks were actually $5 on the Joann's ad. So she let me do that, and I went ahead and got the Vintage Collector stack, and I think most of you have seen... Oops, sorry, guys. I keep hitting the camera. I think most of you have seen this stack from DCWV. And I, again, I don't have this stack, so I am adding that to my collection. Not that I needed more paper, but for $5, I can use it. So while I was there, I also saw the Maggie Holmes crate paper um, stack, and I fell in love with the stack because of this sheet right here. Um, if anybody knows photography, this is what they call Boke, B-O-K-E-H, I think, is how you pronounce it. Um, this is the same image, sort of, that I use on my YouTube channel, actually. Um... But they have a sheet that looks like that, and I love that sheet. And so this was regular price, but because, and it's double-sided, I didn't realize that. Is it double-sided? I'm going from the other side. Nope, it's not double-sided. I'm on the back side. Sorry, guys. So maybe I can show you that piece larger. Oh, here is a larger image of that piece of paper that I like. But this is a 12 by 12 as well, and... um. I love the colors in this one, too, because they're kind of, like, muted and vintage. But they're still very bright in some spots. I you know, like that one. Um, I love all the colors that are used in this. So there's that piece of paper that I loved. Right here. I love that. I can take images like that because I have, I have all the equipment for it. But anyway... Um, this was $19.99 regularly. I have a 50% off coupon from AC More, which I used for this pad, so it ended up being $10. So that's fine. Don't mind that. Um, and this is not a DCWV stack. It's a crepe paper stack. So, um, yeah, 48 sheets in there. And then 
I went to TJ Maxx because, as I said, it's right next door to Michael's. And I hadn't been in there in a long time. So I went through the aisles. This was a dollar for this, um, what do you call it, post-it note stack. Um, and it says, luckily, she enjoyed fishing as she had just opened up another can of worms. And so I will probably put this in a rack because I like to include stuff like that. Um, they also had these journaling cards from Studio Calico, and I'm trying to get them to... Well, let me just show the back. Okay, so here is the little journaling cards that are in this package, and they are nautical-themed. So um, I got a couple of packs of this because they're only $2, and they are there are... 12 journaling cards, 12 four by three journaling cards in here. And they were two dollars each for the for the packages. So I got a couple of those to share. And they had this. I have to turn it this way. Dear Lizzie Neapolitan stack, 12 by 12 stacks at TJ Maxx for $5.99. Yay! So I think I actually have two of these stacks already. Um, they had plenty of these. And in case anybody has not seen this stack, um, here's the pages. It's really cute paper. I love the strawberries. So for those of you, I mentioned my challenge giveaway that I'm having. For those of you that are planning on doing a project for the challenge, this will be included in the giveaway prize pack one of the giveaway prize package because there's two prize packages and if you're interested watch the video and you will see um, all the information there um, listed so I'll go I go through the whole thing in the video so you'll know what the deal is with the prize packs there are two prize packs and this will be inside of one of the prize packs I love this because, look, it's got mason jars. Anyway. Um, so that's the Neapolitan Dear Lizzie. Oh, but wait. I had found one more stack that I really love. And it is not a new one. This is the Frith and Frolic 12 by 12 stack. It was $5.99 at TJ Maxx. I am so happy I found this because I think I've been hoarding it. I have the paper pack, the collection kit, the collection kit with all of the embellies, and I think I was hoarding it because I didn't want to break into it. I love the paper in here. So there's some cutaways, and you can tell the colors are very much similar to what I've already shown you. And the other collections, I don't know what it is about this one but I love the colors in it I love that one um, and so I think I was hoarding it because of of that reason I love this one too um, so now I don't have to and for those of you who watch my other video you'll know that I also brought the I bought the project life kit that is the fifth and project frolic who excuse me Project Life Kit. So I was going to go and look in Joann's and see if they had this one, but now I don't have to because I have not one. I have two stacks. <laughs> so I'm not sure if I'm going to put this in a giveaway because I have to check and see what I do have of it. And if I do have another pad already, I may include it in the collection, in the, sorry, in the winnings. Um, but I'm not sure. So Anyway, that is my haul for today, and I hope you enjoyed it, and I hope everybody is having a good week, because tomorrow is Friday! Yay! Oh, one more thing. I didn't ever show this. This is some potpourri I got, too. I love the way this looks. Um, this is vanilla, vanilla coconut potpourri. It smells so good, but look at the colors in it. Orange and pink and brown. So pretty. Anyway... That's all for tonight. For tonight, I'm going to get to crafting, and I'll talk to you guys soon. Bye!